Anything. Everything. It's warm. We can probably use this boat. If I can just get it free. Careful, lad. Ah! Why are these things so fast? to a lively start. Petraeus, you dropped your guard. I got the boat free, though. We can head through these channels when you're ready. I still can't believe Mom led a whole rebellion here against Odin and never talked about it. The fact that it didn't go well might have covered that notion. What your mother did before we met was her business. Did you ever ask? Eyes on the water. They are resources. <laughs> if you never asked Mom about what she used to do, what did you talk about when you met? Like, did you just say, Woman, guard the house. I will go to catch fish in the river. And then leave for five days? No. Your mother was far better at fishing than I. <laughs> that wheel is blocking the channel. I imagine if you can turn it, we should be able to get through. So these are wetlands, huh? Pretty accurate. It is a bog. The smell is making my eyes burn. You know what is a fair bit more potent than when I was visited, now that you mention it. He was a friend to the Giants. I wonder if he and Mom ever met. If he was a part of the Rebellion here. It's certainly possible. The God of War often advocated for the Giants. Although I don't recall if he ever declared allegiance outright. Come on. There's gotta be a faster way to get down there.
Okay, there's gotta be some way to turn the wheel up here. Well there! Give a man some warning if he's about to suddenly end up snout deep in cheek. The ground. Was that an earthquake? Hmm. An occasional but not unheard of happenstance in Spartalfheim. With all the mining here, the land's bound to be a wee bit bothered. Think you can reach the wheel from here? Oh wow, nice job getting it to lower exactly where we need it. I was thinking, because it's so warm, maybe it's not that the cold hasn't made it here yet, but maybe it's just different in Spartalfarm? Aye, lad. Thimble Winter doesn't strike all realms quite the same way. Weird that Thimble Winter doesn't always make it winter. In Midgard it does, but as you can see, the effects here appear far more gaseous in nature. Observe the geysers. Observe the aforementioned aroma. These effects were present before in some form, but now there's new extremity to them. Think we can fit under that bridge? Father, up there.
Those guys are... Hmm. I think we need to get that wheel moving, but the water doesn't reach. Hmm? Yes! The wheel's moving and the gate's coming down. That's more of an ingenuity for you. Back to the boat. If the dwarves of this realm are anything like Rock and Sindri, it's hard to imagine them siding with Odin. Well, all too often people are blinded to all but their immediate self-interest. Odin offered them safety, and defying him can be quite dangerous. Maybe they just need a couple of gods to come along and take the fight to him. Atreus, that is not why we are here. I was only joking. War is not a joke, especially where gods are concerned. This place is wrecked. And yes, I am staying alert. There are probably tons of those Grim around. Come <laughs> on. 
Good thing you learned the runes, brother. That's everything here. Want to get going? Atreus, you intend to recruit Tyr as an ally for war. I just... I'm trying to keep our options open. Let's just keep moving. I'm glad we're out here, exploring a new realm. Maybe we could just try to enjoy the warmth? Looks like we gotta find a way to open that gate if we want to get to Nidavolir. Too fast. Then how shall we catch it? Flank it. Attack from behind. Good. <laughs> oh! <laughs> you did it. Let's see what it dropped. Father. Up there. Half 
halfway there. There's got to be another chain to lower the rest of the gate. Look, there's a chain we can pull up there. You can uncover that geyser from here. Geyser. The pressure will turn the wheel. Can you see anything from that block? That's one of Cavassia's poems. Very highbrow. You should collect any others you find. Glad, <laughs> if I may. What exactly are you hoping to learn from Tia? Well, like I said, I was hoping he could tell me something about Loki. I'd also like to hear some of his stories. Traveling to other lands, giant stuff, and maybe about what it was like to fight back in the day. Just for the history, obviously. History? <laughs> Let's hope Tia's in a talkative mood after being imprisoned for so long. Not all of Odin's captives can be as charmingly voluble as myself. We have no proof Tyr is truly here. Right. Earthquake earlier. Do you think there will be another one? It's unlikely, but geological disturbances tend to be unpredictable. If the geysers and smell here are worse because of Fimble Winter, maybe the earthquakes are too? Aye, you might be onto something, lad. Atreus, look ahead. Wow. Now this looks like a city. Welcome to neither of the brothers. Hey, dwarves! Oh. They're, uh, running away. An alarm. I'd only sound an alarm like that if I still had my body. 
and was fearing the notion of being detached from it. Why all that for us, though? They are scared. Most definitely an alarm, I'm afraid. Why is everybody hiding? Stay alert. Talk to you for trouble, please. There'll be no help, to be sure. Best we find the tavern Sindri mentioned on our own, and hope they let us in.